this is my little science project. Mmm. This one be powdered, mostly powdered cayenne and cayenne peppers with some habanero and some African bird peppers and some homegrown peppers, I might add. This is what I do two or three times a day, every day, two weeks at least until I strain it, shake them up real good. This is the already strained out tincture. This is about two and a half quarts of these strained out into this. This is the good stuff right here. This is another one just like that one, the first one I showed you. Got to shake it twice, at least twice every day. This is in a hundred proof, hundred proof vodka, with a little bit of GPA added to jack up the uh, 50 percentile alcohol to about 60, 65 percent alcohol, so it lasts forever. These are the African bird pepper mixes I just put up a few days ago. African bird pepper, mmm another African bird pepper mmm shake it up really good another African bird pepper now I'm gonna let these sit for about a month before I strain these out the first batch I set for a little over two weeks they recommend 14 days minimum. Another African bird pepper. Mmm. <laughs> now this one, this one is a straight hap, you know, crushed habanero pepper very intense very dark oil in this nice flavor it's about 350,000 Scoville units in this baby at least probably more hell yeah I shake them up every day Wow, awesome.